Yay, this is a Jump Gamer. Today I have some news from Animal Crossing Jump Out, which will be released on November 8th in Japan. This Nintendo Direct will be for Animal Crossing 3DS only, and I will show you more details of the game here. The game is all about relaxing and enjoying your life at the village of animals, where the time is synchronized to the real world. Talk to an animal, do some fishing, place furniture in your room, or do whatever you feel like. There's no story that you need to follow, you can play it at your own pace. In this sixth series, you play as a new mayor and can customize your village by placing items or making a new regulation that fits your playing style. It will be your own unique village. Besides that, the house is more customizable. Also, you can draw patterns on your clothes. The gaming experience can be more individual than ever. Today, we have creators of the game here for you. To you like to explain more details about them? Hi. My name is Eguchi, I'm the producer of the game. I will present you more details in Animal Crossing Jump Out with developers of the game. Please introduce yourself, guys. Hi, my name is Aya, I'm the director of the game. Hello, my name is Isao, I'm another director of the game. I am Alisa, I am a planner of the game. Now, Aya will show you how on village, so let's see it and talk about it. I will show you my village I made. It's called Hokotate. Hmm. Many flowers. <laughs> There's a bridge too. <laughs> the front yard is beautiful. I need to give them water. The flowers are dying. The new shiny effect on the flowers is a new feature. They indicate that you have just given them water so you can see which one needs next. So it's bushy trees that sit past the also new under. Yes, they are. We call it shrub at the moment in the dev team. These are like bush and uh, small plants. There are some candies over there. See, but letters on the ground that she designed on my design. <laughs> I wanted everyone to walk this road. That's well written. This is a campsite. Building things like this is also one of mayor's work. At the campsite, you sometimes see that animals who are not living in your village come here and place a tent. Here's a recycle shop, alpacas. The couple of the animals called alpaca, so it's a shop's name. At this shop, you can sell stuff that you have got. It used to be Tom Nook who buys stuff from me. Now, Lisa here will be in charge of buying out. Here you can actually do more things. As you can see, you can place your unused furniture here and decide a price on your own. So other players or animals can buy them.
If you happen to have found an animal who seems to be still deciding whether to purchase your stuff, you can actually talk to them and talk them into buying it. Let's try that out now. Sometimes they say, I will think about it, and you get refused. You can make a fortune by set a higher price on it. I sell stuff here, the animals send me as a present that I thought is useless. That's me. Uh, here's my house. The new things here is the furniture on the wall, the plant over there, and uh, this is a music record. Every record has its own design now, and you can use it to decorate your place. I have my hobby room upstairs. Placing things like the bench and the clock are also the mayor's work. Matching some object with others will look them prettier. Here's the mayor's office. Let's try out some of the work he can do. To start it, you will first sit down the chair. In case there's something in your way where you want to build, you can do removal of the object as well, though there are also things you cannot get rid of. The top here is a cu quite cute. It looks nice. I don't like the cheap one, we'll go for the round one. It's her village. She decides everything. <laughs> These choices will reflect the personality or the taste of every beer. Once you decide what to build, you will go out to look for where to build it. I'm thinking of making here a park. What do you think? Okay, I will decide that to be here. I planning to build a playground and stuff around here. Yes, I do. Now here comes Mr. Lloyd. She said chipping. Let's call it fundraising. He's gonna get some money around for the round topiary that I wanna build. You can do it all with your own money. Or you can just rely on other players or animals from outside of the village. <laughs> it's 93,000 bills. I have donated quite a lot since I have some money to spare today. This is a new item, megaphone. You can use it to call an animal in the village by using voice recognition system of 3DS. He's in South West. The bubble indicates where an animal you called is located. Now he's here. You can find an animal like this. So when you're asked to give an item or call someone, It'll be quite useful. I've shown the village enough. Now we'll pay a visit to the shopping mall. 